In this tutorial, what we're going to do is we're going to use if statements in Excel and create dummy variables from a categorical variable. As you see here, we have our data set that we're going to use for regression. We have our individuals, individual IDs, the distance that they traveled, the age of the individual, and we have this variable p sex, which is uh, indicates the gender of the individual. As you'll recognize, the, the, um, the gender variable is what we call a categorical variable. It has two levels, one and two, but because it's a categorical variable, and because the categories themselves are one and two, we can't use them in our regressions directly. What we have to do is change our categorical variable into dummy variables, that is variables that have a one or a zero, and those we can use in our regression. So that's what we're going to do. What we're going to do specifically here is create a variable for women. So we'll call this variable p female. And we're going to use an if statement to create our dummy variable. So in order to use our if statement, we press equals here. We're going to type in if. And you'll see that Excel automatically provides you with information that you need to give, the arguments you need. You need, first of all, a logical test, the value if it's true, and the value if it's false. Now, the logical test in this case will be that if this variable is a 2, it means that the person is a woman. And so we're going to say that if this variable, if this variable is equal to 2, then if it is the case, we're going to give it a 1. And if it's not the case, we want it to be assigned a value of 0. So in this case, as you'll see, because this is 2, the if statement should return us a value of 1, which it does. Now, we can copy this to the rest of our data. And we have, in each case where it's, there's a 2, it, will be, it means it's a female, and so the p female variable will have a value 1. In the cases that it's 1, the p female variable will have a 0. We now have a data set that we can use for regression, where we have one continuous independent variable, age, and another a discrete binary or dummy variable for gender. In the next video, we will do a regression using this data.